going to YouTube, this is Louisiana Inferno, so I'm here to talk to you guys today about a card called Forbidden Lance. Now, um, this is a really good card right now. Um, it, pr it protects your card, uh, your monsters one of two ways. Uh, if you don't know what it does, let me read it to you first. Um, it's a quick play spell, select one face of monster on the field. Until the end phase, it loses 800 attack, but is unaffected by the effects of other spell or trap cards. Now, this can protect your cards by um, battle and also by effect. So, um, let's say you have your monster and you attack with it and they dimensional prison. You can chain lance to it and it will protect your monster from um, the prison. Also from bottomless trap hole, uh, dark hole, things like that. Also, um, the other way it protects it is <coughs> um, by battle damage. So if um, you have like a Thunder King and they attack you with like a Leviathan Dragon or something like that, um, and you just lance the Leviathan Dragon and then it be, uh, wouldn't have enough attack to run over Thunder King. So, what decks is this especially good in? Um, this is definitely a good card in Rescue Rabbit. Um, it's probably the most broken in Rescue Rabbit because um, Rabbit decks, um, you know, you want to, your you want your opponent wants to make you waste your Logia effects like as soon as possible because you have to use both your materials on your Logia. But if you Lance to protect it from things like Dark Hole, um, then you have like a bottomless set to protect it from like. Uh, for the turn, then you you really set up for like you're you're gonna be good to go. Um, Lance is really good at protecting like um, Dolka because it doesn't have a protection from um, things like Dark Hole. Uh, it's really useful, and it's also if you're running Direct Guba, which you should be running uh, if you're running the Defrager build. Um, this works really well with Guba because it can run over anything like 2,500 or less. Next, another deck that this card is really good in is the Gladiator Beasts. Um, Gladiator Beasts are really versatile deck, and what they try to do is survive the attack, uh, survive the battle phase. So in order to survive the battle phase, let's say um, you attack with your um, Laquari, and they have a Dimensional Prison or Mirror Force. You can lance it, and it would protect it, and then it would survive, so a thousand attack would go through, and then you would tag out. So essentially, it's a one for one. You lance in, in their mirror force, but then your Laquari gets to tag out and plus. So essentially, it, it works as a plus. Also, it works as a mini shrink. So when they have things like Leviathan Dragon again, 2500 attack, attack your uh, Laquari. Just damage step, lance, and then um, it would be down to 1700, and your Laquari would run it over in battle. And then you could tag out. Um, another deck that I think personally this could be good in, just as a tech card, uh, I haven't really seen it used before in that deck, but I think it would be pretty nice to try out, is Karakuris. Um, Karakuris have <clears throat> a lot of spell cards in their deck already. Um, one Lance I think would be really useful in protecting things like, um, firstly, the Genix Neutron play. Uh, if you're going second and you want to start off with a good play, you want your Genix Neutron to survive to the end phase. So if you summon Genix Neutron and they try to bottomless, you just lance it, and then you um, so you're essentially trading your lance for a a Karakuri card that will make help you go off combo people. Um, no, another reason this is good is useful for protecting things like Landois, um, because it negates spell uh, monster effects by discarding the spell. So you can discard this if you don't need it, but also you could use it to protect it from things like Dark Hole and Bottomless, of course, just gene those generic cards that I keep talking about. Um, it's also good for protecting your mark uh, Beast, Nature Beast, because it is a little bit on the puny side, 2200 for a level 5. Um, so, uh, even though it does negate your opponent's spells, if they just get a big monster out, um, you can use this to, for them to lose 800 attack and defense. Um, so that's pretty useful. Um, so I just really think that uh, Lance is a really flexible card. I uh, can use them like a lot of decks, but the best three decks that I would say, um, Rabbit, it's really useful in uh, to protect your Dragon Exceeds. It's good in um, Gladiator Beast because it can be used for attack or defense purposes. And um, I think it should be a tech card in characters just because of, um, especially because of the Neutron play but also to protect your uh, Beast and Landois and even Barkeon if you need to. Alright, thanks guys. That's it for me today. 3 Inferno, signing out.